Tomorrow we will begin to read the fourth book of the Torah, the book of Bamidbar, and then straight after that we go into the holiday of Shavuos, the time when Hashem gave us the Torah and selected us as a unique nation among nations, when He called us His kingdom of priests and His Am Segula, His treasured nation. It's a time when we took on a tremendous responsibility to be moral and to teach the world morality, something that we still continue to have to do until today. Now, when the Jews arrived at Mount Sinai, ready to receive the Torah, it's interesting, and you'll read about this on Monday morning, that it says, Vayichan Sham Yisrael Neged Hahar, that the Jewish people camped across from the mountain. And it says, Vayichan, which is a singular word, in spite of the fact that it was speaking about three million people. And the commentaries say, what does that mean? It means, Ke'ish Echad Belev Echad, that they were like one person with a single heart. Which is interesting because just before that, as the Jews were chased by the Egyptians before the miracle of the splitting of the sea, the Egyptians are are expressed, are described as with one heart as one person. Fascinating, isn't it? It's a stark insight into the distinction between the Jewish people and its enemies. We are Keish Echad. It is our intrinsic reality that we're one person. It doesn't matter where you stand on the political spectrum. It doesn't matter what your religious views. We are one. And if we don't believe that, our enemies will always remind us they don't distinguish between the religious and the non-religious. They don't distinguish based on our political opinion. They have the same animosity towards all of us. That is our reality. It is inescapable. And therefore, what's for us to do is to be believe echad, to care for each other, to be in a state of unity, to stand wherever we may stand in the world and do something meaningful, something holy and spiritual, to care for the other part of our oneness, our fellow Jew. May Hashem protect all of Israel. May Hashem keep us all safe and sane. Have a good Shabbos and a good yomtev.